eyes Mr. New Mobile here. Samsung has officially confirmed the announcement of the Galaxy Note 20 in the Fold 2, or actresses the Fold 2 coming officially on August 5th. Please subscribe followed by the bell. You can also keep up on Facebook, Twitter by clicking the links in the description. This is brand information. We already knew this was the date at least a month ago that's showing off a droplet. Coming down in a slow motion, and it also shows the expense of pretty much we know that it's a van regarding the Galaxy Note during the end of course full do it will be. Streamed online on Samsung.com and on YouTube so is starting to be a physical event. And now let's see if they can actually match. Apple with their amazing WWDC event that happened recently to the craziness. That is coming out is regarding the Galaxy S21 next year, Samsung could ditch two major things that will completely change the smartphone game. The board decision as we have talked about it before with the iPhone drowned that Apple might actually not ship. The charger inside the box and everyone is pretty much trolling up over this decision, and now it seems like Samsung now, so nothing is completely official. With the resuspension for this decision is very similar to what we have already heard with the iPhone 12, so there are three possible reasons behind this major decision. First up is e-waste as it were, by the verse. Already we had 1.5 billion smartphones that were shipped last year, and with all the smartphones. It is estimated that we have 300,000 tons of Eve is just coming. From the inbox chargers. Humans have left a record amount of the race in 2019, and majority of this came from electronic grants in the last five years, so Samsung and Apple start getting chargers out of the box. This could bring these numbers drastically down. Another reason that is mentioned is the abundance of the existing fast charger so in Samsung case. If you're someone who's looking to buy the Galaxy S21, then chances are you have used to Samsung phone in the last two or three years whether it was the Galaxy S A Cs or S9 West North Carolina S chances are you have a fast charger already inside your house. So in case of Samsung this reason definitely makes a lot of sense. Even if you had still actually comes with iPhone 11 so some people may still have to spend extra money for that. Upcoming new 20 water charger, but chances of Samsung fast charging being in a household is a lot more. And the third and final reason is the growing price of smartphone as we have seen. Already with the Galaxy S20 line of the pricing were absolutely insane. Starting from $1000. This will surely bring down the price now once again this is something that is currently being discussed at Samsung, if they actually do this, it will most likely happen with the Galaxy S21 next year, and eventually from there we can see more and more smartphone not coming. With the charger out of the box. Is what is said that at first, people trolling Apple massively. But here you go Samsung is doing this is where you can drop your thoughts in the comments below. Also Samsung is not stopping there. We have another big day story, and this could actually be a good news, according to the rumor Samsung could drop the Quantum Snapdragon. Chips it on their flagship Galaxy is 21. Curvature on its display price universes advised that while we will be seeing trim down vessels around the curve on the Note 20 Ultra is going to be a steep curve, similar to its predecessor. It's always a stranger when it comes to the Note, as I do love the look of a curve. I feel and the Note 20 Ultra, which shows a difference in camera modules, the label to the Note 20, and the Note 20 Plus we know from recent certification. The Note 20 Pluses can be called the Note 20 Ultra we can see from the images, though the Note 20 Ultra has considerably larger camera module at the same time. That shouldn't come as a surprise. After the recent S20 Ultra 5 61.8 x 75.3 x 8.5 mm, which makes the Note 21 mm thicker than its predecessor significantly larger overall. One thing that you may have already noticed is a flat display on the Note 20, I'm assuming this is can please a lot of you my most complained about features in the comment is of course the curved display. You can see the on the Note 20 record the volume and the home buttons on the right hand side, using the left side completely clear. We take a look underneath record USB Type-C port microphone, a speaker, grow, and the S Pen at the far left. The same tray is now located at the top of the Galaxy Note 20 on the rear record rectangular camera module, similar to the S range, is 38.1 mm long by 21.9 wide Samsung's range, is 38.1 mm long by 21.9 wide Samsung reportedly still working on these cameras, so we don't have any confirmation on what they can be it's expected. It will contain either the HM1 or the GN1 from Samsung. We can of course see that we've got three lenses on the left with the periscope lens on the right underneath the LED flash. You can see the back panel is curved on both edges with a slight comes in all corners, and overall looks like a comfortable device to hold, and still a very premium smartphone. Next up we got my favorite which is the Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Plus. These vendors were provided by Pictalan on leaks. 
We have most of the details of this still some unconfirmed information. The Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Plus is coming with the largest 6.9-inch curved Amarillo display recorder, poncho camera top center, we have plenty of display from Ross Young. We have since deleted the tweet. Since we can only assume there's an issue always been asked to remove them we're expecting an LTPO display, but again with the Poncho Sophie camera is in display cameras just ready, yet the Note 20 Plus dimensions the Poncho Sophie camera is in display cameras just ready, yet the Note 20 Plus dimensions come in at 165 x 77.2 x 7.6 mm with the trim down bezels. It is pretty much full screen with the volume and power buttons on the right hand side with the left completely smooth. The bottom now is the same as the Note 20 with the S Pen at the far left, followed by speaker USB port and microphone on the rear. We got another rectangular camera housing we can see it is a little bit different from the smaller Note 20 have to say. I much prefer this one looks a little bulky with bigger lenses, actually really like these camera rings, and I think it adds to the premium look the device we got to cameras on the left, which reportedly could be the Samsung HM1 and the GN1 with the periscope lens underneath over on the right hand side, see a true depth camera underneath the LED flash. Again, the edges account on the back, and overall it looks like it can be a great device. We still haven't had any details on the pricing, and probably won't until close to the launch towards the end of the year. This can be interesting to see why they price it, the Note line is always the most towards the end of the year. This can be interesting to see why they price it, the Note line is always the most premium of the range well apart from the newly added followed the S range, with price relatively high, that sold less than expected it, so this could affect the pricing on the Note. One thing we do know though is that with the Note we'll get improved display factory camera and general hardware, and of course we don't have much longer until it's going to be released now can run through all of the specs of the Samsung Galaxy Note 20, and the Note 20 Plus of my regular viewers, you guys have already seen it, so I suggest you switch off now if you're new here, then, don't forget to hit subscribe and we'll get right into it, of, subscribe and we'll get right into it, of, of course the Samsung Galaxy Note 20 is can be an incredible smartphone, actually one of my favorite releases this year, will likely see improved design display cameras, and more for anyone who's missed my previous videos, will quickly run through what we can expect you would s range in the past, things have been changing lately to be interesting to see what screen sizes we get with the Galaxy Note 20 last year, we had the Note in two sizes, which was 6.3 inch and 6.8 inch displays. We then have a light model come later with a 6.7 inch display. Given that the S range has massively increased in size, with a 6.9 inch display now coming under the estimate that we could see a Galaxy Note 20 with at least a 7 inch display. Of course, more often, sizes are generally getting larger, so publicizes are going to rise to given the success of last year's notes also can predict we'll be getting a Galaxy Note 21, with the Galaxy Note 20 Plus, we haven't had any solid leaks or information when it comes to displays, trying to predict a 6.5 inch display on the Galaxy Note 27 inch display on the Galaxy Note 20 Plus expecting Take the decision of completely growing eggs in this worldwide. With all affairs Galaxy is 21 models, and it would also be another strong reason behind this move, and that is the AMD GPU inside the Exodus 1005 NM chip as we have seen in a very early benchmark the game. The GPU inside the Exynos 5 NM chip actually outperforms the Snapdragon GPU by a mile. We're talking the existing staffing age 65 TPU. It was a very early benchmarks of the final finished product could even surpass. The GPU inside the stomach and a 75 again and he is a big name in the game. The brand new one multi-view. For the Galaxy is 21 based on Redna architecture. It could actually change the whole game. I would love to see Samsung going Christmas and the worldwide because. Why would you have these differences every year just have one chipset and have that. Equal performance in all the markets so. Big crazy news day. Indeed Samsung could be ditching the clock and serving a 75. Chair along the way that the fast charges. Are the box now we don't addition to the charger. So we still have to wait and see. More news on this, but right now the main ditching thing is the charger out of the box. As always Galaxy Note 20 is completely unaffected from these changes. It is still coming with the 25 watts fast. Charger out of the box as well as the headphones we actually have more news coming from Jimmy, who is there, being the source of Galaxy Note 20. Live images and according to his source, the new has been on the Galaxy Note 20 can act as a proper pointer to launch applications from a distance, actually. So there's a full option to increase the size of the pointer as well as the color of the pointer so you don't really use your fingers to launch applications, you can definitely use the X-Men to do that so. That is all the news we have for today. Let me know your thoughts.
the comments below. I cannot wait to read the comments section. Because like I said people have been trolling Apple. Day in day out every single time I uploaded. Video. I always see this, Galaxy is 21 please subscribe, like the video, comment, thanks for watching see you on my next video 1p.